Going on, it's not welcome along to a brand new video. Now, yesterday you may remember we played Postmortem 01. Well, today we're going to play Postmortem 02 Prelude. And um, pretty sure I played the previous one, but I know for sure I haven't played this one because this is a brand new map that only came out at the middle of this month. So, Postmortem 02 Prelude. Um, version 3 was released. I fixed the poor switching bug and a few others. You can read the full change log here. Postmortem is a series of maps in which I explore some of my favourite test elements, gameplay mechanics and visuals from Portal series mixed with whatever is going on in my head. I have no exact release date for the episode 3. It's been several months since I released episode 1, so don't expect anything soon. Sorry. I let new ideas come to me instead of committing to a linear and predictable timeline. The map, inspired by epistolary events, whatever that means, this map will expand the character's backstory as requested from episode 1. I tried to go for puzzles with less elements as inspired by the first Portal game. You'll see nothing but the 1500 megawatt aperture science, heavy duty, heavy super colliding, super button weighted storage cubes and emancipation grills. I also wanted to work with a single Portal device. I hope you enjoy. I had lots of fun creating this one. It's the biggest map I've ever made. Quite a challenge. And we got some thanks. Thanks for playing. So without further ado, let's load up the map. And... Um, See if we get a nice little fancy pants intro like we did on uh, the first map that we played yesterday. Looks like we are. But it's happening a bit quicker this time, which is good. Kind of dragged on a little bit the first time, first from the first map. I didn't know, really know what was going to happen. Oh, this is cool though. This is cool. That was freaky. All right, episode two, prelude. Some blueprints for something. Printed by Dre. There's Borealis. Uh. Excuse me. Excuse me. Well, I guess we can go down here. Interesting. Into a cave system. Do a minecart to ride, man. So much more cool. So much quicker. It's like the hedgehog styley. Music, building up the suspense as we head down the mine shaft. All right, so kind of reminds me a bit of um, Penumbra. Powered by Aegis. Let's get to see facial recognition available. Please insert key card. Welcome. Now back to work. Really? It's like one of those things that you see in like a secret agent film. It's like door after door after door. That's quite comical. Okay. It's a room. Separated by... A grate. But the room contains nothing. Okay. Anyway. Can we? Ooh, man, this looks nice. Command standing by in three, two, one. Oh, this is a recreation of the actual. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, 
and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are this is one of the Portal 1 maps, isn't it? Rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have erased the ear tubes inside your head. Yeah. It's an actual map from Portal. It's like all been destroyed and everything. Apply screen shake. Changing lighting. Teleport player. You know, usual sort of jazz. Uh, excuse me? This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God, God help, help you. you. Alright, so. Where are we going to go to? I want to go over here. Okay. It's very dark and dingy. Okay, have a hunch that I was actually meant to um, probably go over there, right? Yeah. Alright, so let's go and um, try that again, shall we? Put it like there, nearer to where the actual fizzler is that we're going to actually pass through. Yeah, see look, that helps. Maybe though. So we take the cube. So I guess we're going to need to press that button first. So, third time lucky. Maybe we can. So we're just going to need to use some like shimmying. Once we gain our bearings. That was close. Oh, you pig. Let's pretend I just fail that. Because I really don't want to do that a fourth time. Okay. So, now. I'm going to go back. Yeah, and you really need to move sideways. Moving forward really does nothing for you at all. How long have I played Portal 4 and I still try and do stupid things? Not long enough, it would seem. Okay, so. Then I actually need to get over to here, right? That would make more sense. Then... Get the cube. And... I'm going to want to do something like this. There we go. And now to get to the exit... So we're going to have to go back to the top again. Okay. I think it would have been nice here just to have a grate. I think you could have got away with using a grate instead of a bit of glass with a hole in it. Don't know that it would have really done too much with regards to like level design and breaking the map. Cool. Congratulations. This pre-recorded congratulations assumes you have mastered the principles of portal momentum. If you have, in fact, 
Nah, you are encouraged to take a moment to reflect on your failure before proceeding into the next chamber. Which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. No? We're not we're not going for that line today, GLaDOS. Okay. Okay. So you performed this test better than anyone on record. This is a pre recorded message. Okay. So Due to events beyond our control, some testing environments may contain flood damage or ongoing tribal warfare resulting from the collapse of civilization. If groups of hunter-gatherers appear to have made this or any test chamber their home, do not agitate them. Test through them. Okay. This cube on here is going to cause that to respawn. So, yeah, I think we're going to need to bring the other cube through. That was weird. Okay, so... Yeah, okay, so... We're gonna wanna do... Put that up there. Go back through here. And now we can pick up this second cube, like so. Recall that one. And place it on the button. Which opens the exit. And now... I guess we're going to want to, like... Go through here and then rotate ourselves. I guess. Maybe I should save. Oop, that was not quite right. Uh, that was. That'll work. Well done. In the event that oxygen is no longer available in the enrichment center, an auxiliary so now we have supply two. will be provided to you by an Aperture Science Test Associate, if one exists. Now we have both. Uh... Elevator to the surface. Take me to the surface, elevator. That don't sound good. This is how we... So, hold on, prelude is like before, right? So this is how we ended up on the first map. So, yeah. Yeah. And this is the first map. Cool stuff. I like it. I like that you're trying to build the story. Uh, thumbs up for me again. I look forward to part three whenever you get around to making it. Guys, as always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any maps you want me to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Discord. You'll find a link to that in the description where you'll find my map suggestions channel. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming.